Tigers and Chai Sox split a double dip on Monday. On Tuesday, the Tigers tapped the train. Dontrell Willis hoping to get back on track, but right away he's in trouble. Uncorking the wild pitch in the first, Scott Podsednik scores. Chai Sox lead it one zip through one. Now 1-1 one, one in the fourth for some fireworks. A.J. Brzezinski, and much like TNT, he knows drama. Grounding out softly 4-3, but words are exchanged. Both benches come out. No punches thrown, no ejections, just a little of that good old testosterone flowing freely out there in the Windy City. Now 3-1 in the bottom of the fifth when the D-train collides with Brian Anderson just over the wall in left center, a two-run shot. We're tied at three. Same score, same frame. The D-train still chugging, working with the bases loaded in two outs. Full extension to snag the grounder by Perzinski, then from his knees to end the frame. It's still 3-3 through five. Top seven now, still three all. Octavia Dotel on in relief of Mark Burley, and he succumbs to the power of Placido Polanco. With the bases loaded to the wall in right center, a bases clearing three-run double by Polanco. Tigers in front 6-3. Bottom nine now, Detroit walks the bases loaded and even walks in a run. It's 6-4. Paul Canerco makes some pay inside the line in left. Two runs scored, to tied at six. Dwayne Wise going to try and score from first to win the ball game, but he's punched out at the dish on a great relay. We're tied at six, heading to extras. Top 10, Miguel Cabrera leading off the inning with his 11th homer, and just like that, the Tigers retake a one-run lead, and this time the lead sticks. 7-6 the final. Despite issuing a dozen walks, including five of the ninth, the Tigers come back to beat Chicago. Brandon Edge and Cabrera each go long.